Hi everybody, I hope everybody had a great week. My puppy and I are back with a what's in my bag video. She just got a haircut. She always looks really cute and funny after a haircut. She, of course, had to place herself right in the middle. Every time I come here to film a video, she just plops right down in the middle because she loves to be the center of attention. I always film in this guest room with the day bed. So she loves to be in here and block the purpose of each video. So today's video is a what's in my bag video featuring this beautiful lambskin bag that I got from Etsy. Basically, it... <laughs> Can I just put this over here? Okay, so once she moves out of the way, I will talk more about this bag. This is a beautiful lambskin leather bag. Oh, yes, my puppy too. She has her bag here. She got this bag recently. She's carrying one of her favorite toys in here, which we'll show everybody afterwards. You had to move forward, didn't you? You had to move even more forward. Without moving her, I'll try to get through as much as I can. Um, I have another video about this bag, so I'll link it below. So I won't get into too much detail over why I bought it but I wanted this designer inspired look but I also wanted a really good quality bag I wanted genuine leather I didn't want anything made out of PU or vegan leather um, so I found this and I absolutely love it and I think it's just the perfect summer bag it's soft I love the color I love the look of it and I can't wait to start wearing it for the summer and I'll also insert a clip of me wearing this bag at the end so you can see how it looks like on my frame so let's just get started on what's in my bag. Let me move my puppy. <laughs> it's always a struggle. Um, okay, so we're gonna show, we're gonna, okay, no, you don't, you do have a very pretty haircut. It's a very nice, <laughs> she has the best little resting face, especially when she's tired. We're gonna move you here. Is that okay? We're gonna move you right here. Oh, I know. I'm so rude. I moved you out of the way. Everybody can still see you though. Hopefully she'll just lay down and go to sleep. All right, so let's just get started with what's in my bag. She is, oh, okay. She, she's being passive aggressive. That's okay. I just don't want you to get hit or anything with the bag. So let's move you over just a little bit more. Yeah, everybody sees your pretty bag. A brief overview, the inside of this bag is also made of lambskin leather. The seller told me the inside and outside are the same material and it has a little pouch in here. So I'm excited to see what all fits. I have a lot of stuff to put in here and show you guys. Okay, so the first item is my wallet. It is the summer, so I am back to using my favorite wallet. This is the YSL Fuchsia wallet. I absolutely love this. It's one of my favorite wallets and what better season to use it than the summer so I am so excited to go back to wearing this oh by the way I did my nails by myself I did a chrome manicure and I am so obsessed with them this has probably been my favorite manicure I've done in a while and I actually did this all by myself I recently did this and it's been about a week and it's still going pretty strong so if you want to see the link to that video too I'll link that below but if you see me just tapping things randomly which I don't normally do it's just because I get so distracted with my new nails apologies for that. But anyways, this is my YSL Hot Pink Wallet. It's really lightweight and I love carrying it. That's going to go first in this bag. And there's really no structure to this bag, so I'm just sliding things in there. And we'll see as we go along. I like to keep my designer wallets pretty empty. I don't want to overstuff them or stretch them out. That wallet just has important items. Anything else like gift cards, I like to keep separately. I am actually packing this because I am going shopping with my mom. We are going to have a shopping day. So I did want to bring all of my gift cards and all of my other cards. And so I'm keeping them in this pouch that I love. I got this from Amazon. It's so cute with the B. It's also designer inspired. I just love the color. And the best part about this is you unzip it and all of your cards go in here so nicely and so organized and you can easily access them. So I love carrying this around. It fits so much cards and it's so lightweight and so convenient to use. I really do love this color that I picked but it also comes in so many different colors. Everything that I talk about this video I'll try to find and link it below. But this is such a cute little card holder for a shopping trip or to just keep track of all of your cards that you don't want to keep in your everyday wallet. So that's going in here. Plenty of space still. 
wallet and card holder. So I'm so excited for this next item. Since forever, I've been using this Louis Vuitton keyring holder. And as you can see, I've emptied it out. I don't know, I just felt like I wanted a change just for the summer. I wasn't really feeling this pattern. I'll probably go back to this in the fall. But for the summer, I wanted something really bright and airy. And I have to have key ring holders because I know from experience that keys will scratch up your accessories and your bag. I do not want my wallet getting scratched up, nor do I want the inside of this bag getting scratched up. So for me, having a key ring holder is a necessity. And I'm so excited I found this. I got it in white. It's so cute. It is genuine leather. That's what it's advertised. And I got it in this beautiful quilted white color with the gold zipper. So basically it comes with a little chain inside and I went and attached all my keys to it. And I even added my little four leaf clover charm that I always keep with me. So all of my keys are here. It just comes attached to this and I just stick it in here. And it's so thin, it's so lightweight. I love the detail of it. It looks super chic and also very designer inspired. So I'm so excited to use this. And I think it looks really good with this handbag. It does feel weird not using this because this has just been a staple in all my purses. I just wanted something new. And I also found this on Amazon. Just gonna put this in here. Hi, you back? You back? She <laughs> fell asleep on her face. So her little face is all smushed up. She is probably the cleaniest puppy ever. She always has to be near me. Sometimes when I'm working, it's not good enough. She has to be in my lap. So she'll scream and cry until I put her in my lap. That's exactly what I wanted. I wanted a clingy lap puppy and I definitely got that. Moving on with what else is in my bag. My key fob. So I love this cover. I just think it makes key fobs so much more exciting. And oh, you like it? My husband's dog just barked downstairs. He's a big Portuguese water dog. He's adorable. Anyways, this is one of my favorites. I love the color. I, hi. I know. You already got so much attention. She's a little dirty because we just got back from the park. So you should be tired, but I guess you don't want to take a nap yet. But anyways, I think this looks really nice and chic and it also protects the key fob. So I'm just gonna stick that in here. I don't really need my key fob. I just need it in my purse. So I don't think I'm gonna put it in this pouch back here. I think I'm just gonna put it in the big compartment. Did you have to scoot closer? Really? Okay. Yes, we all know you have the prettiest little bag. It is the best little bag, I know. Okay, next I have a catch-all. I got this Louis Vuitton pochette it's in this bi-color. <laughs> Hi, are you interested? I've literally had this out. You were not interested, but now you are. I think it's really cute, and I think it matches this bag really well. And surprisingly, it fits a good amount of stuff. So what I have in here is my Vaseline. I always have this with me. A scrunchie. You like this scrunchie? Do you want to play with it? Why don't you go play with it over there? Oh. Why don't you go play with it over there? Oh, actually, I don't know. Okay, that's fine. All right. And then I have a Benefit Give Me Brow. I don't like wearing makeup, but brow makeup is essential for me because I really like brows. Aw, it's a little baby yawn. And then I have a 24-hour moisturizer just in case I want some moisturizer. I use this on my hands, my face. <laughs> I'm yawning. Aw, I'm going to take this back now. This is just nice to have a moisturizer with me and it's compact and travel size. Refresh eye drops, always. And then I just carry this with me wherever I go. It's a, there I go with the tapping again. It's just this rose quartz glass roller. And I like to put eucalyptus in here. It's just really calming. And I really like that it's a roller applicator. So it's so easy to apply. It's just fun to have with me. This is just a purse essential I have. And then since it's the summer, it's just so nice to have a Kula SPF setting spray. It's SPF 30. It's organic and it's considered a setting spray so if I am wearing makeup I can spray this on but also because it has SPF in it if I feel like my sunscreen's running low I can just spray this so it's good to have something like this for the summer and I love travel size items and small items that I like to carry with me in my purse so all of that can fit in this little pochette so this is also going to be going in here Everything's in there. So far, so good. 
And these are just some items that I'll have with me, but I don't feel like putting in a bag. This is just a little spray perfume. It's Viva La Juicy. I just like the color. I love the scent and it's very thin. It has a cap on it, so I'm not really afraid of it leaking. And so I just like to keep this with me. That's gonna go in there. This is my Dior lip oil. It's just good to have in the summer to moisturize your lips. Again with the tapping, I just can't stop tapping these. I think the pink is a really cute pink for the summer. Moisturizing your lips is definitely important for the summer. So I have that in there. And then I like to keep a misting spray with me. This is just a little spray bottle that I got from a travel kit. I don't really remember where I got it from, but I just fill it with some rose water. So it's like refreshing. You can just put regular water in here too. Just great to have in the summer. And of course it's very securely shut and it has a lid too. So I'm not really afraid of it leaking. I think I'm gonna put these three items in this zip compartment here just to keep it more secure. I think I like that. I'll put that there. I always keep this with me. It is a Chanel compact mirror. I don't need a compact mirror because this bag came with one. So it came with this mirror, but I don't know. I'm just so used to carrying this with me. It's just a little Chanel compact mirror. There's nothing fancy about it, but I'm just so used to carrying it around with me. So this was pretty pricey for a compact mirror, but I think it's worth it. It's just really nice. It really elevates handbags. I don't really see a purpose for replacing a compact compact mirror very often. That's just going to go in this little side pocket as well. I think that's it for this little side pocket. Everything else will go in the main pocket. Actually, one more thing to put in the side pocket. I have these Winky Lux oil blotting sheets. Can't stop tapping things. It's just so fun. I just like how pretty they are. I got these from Target randomly. Summertime, why not keep these with me? They're pretty lightweight, so I'm just gonna put them in this compartment too. All right, that's the last thing going in that compartment. And then I have my hand sanitizer. This is a refillable hand sanitizer spray bottle that I got from Amazon. It sprays like that, and then there's a really, oh, I'm sorry. I know it smells like hand sanitizer, doesn't it? I just bought some liquid hand sanitizer and filled it here. I really like this little container. It has many different colors, and I'm using the hot pink one. That's gonna go in here somewhere. And then my sunglasses, I got this beautiful quilted pouch from Amazon that I like to carry my sunglasses in when I put sunglasses in my purse. It's really lightweight and I love the way it looks. I got a pack of two. I got the pink and the black one. I think I also want to buy a white one. I love the way it looks and feels. This is not genuine leather though. For the summer, I have my Fendi pink logo sunglasses. I don't think you can see, but there's the Fendi logo on the glasses. And again with the tapping, just tap 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 they're pretty cool for the summer why not love them got these from nordstrom wrap and i got a really good deal on them so sunglasses go in there and then <laughs> just because the other day i was at target and i was like you know what orange tic tac just for some reason i had forgotten about these and these just remind me so much of my childhood i just love these things what I've noticed is when I'm craving sweets, like when I crave candy or like Sour Patch Kids, if I just take some Tic Tacs or some Altoids or something, it kind of satisfies that craving and it's way less calories. So I like carrying something like this with me so I can deal with those cravings and not go and like splurge on candy or something. Orange Tic Tacs are what I'm feeling right now. I don't know why I just shook that, but that was really fun. And then I, of course, I have my phone. It has a complete full body protective case on, which I really love. I drop my phone all the time and having a full case is a necessity. Putting that in here. There's everything in this purse and that's it. That's what's in my purse. I will insert a clip of me wearing the bag so you can see how it looks like on my frame. Even though this bag can be dressed up or dressed down, I decided to pair it with a very comfortable and casual outfit for my shopping trip. I really like the way the bag looks from the side. I think the side profile is really chic and it's a really comfortable bag to wear. It's really easy to reach in and grab necessities even though you probably have to remove it as a shoulder bag. And just for reference I am about 5'1". The bag doesn't feel heavy at all and the quality is really great. I love the way it looks with items inside. The shape is really nice. It's just overall a really great handbag. What's in my puppy's bag? I put a little toy in here for her. It is her little chewy Vuitton. <laughs> How cute is this? Oh, it's cool. <laughs> 
goes. She just likes to kind of carry this around and chew on it but I guess she's just not interested right now because there's a lot going on outside and she likes to spy on everybody. She knows everything about the neighborhood. She's the self-appointed neighborhood watch. Anyways that's my video for today. I hope you enjoyed watching. If you did please consider subscribing. I make videos once a week about luxury and lifestyle. Thank you so much and have a wonderful week. Bye!